A beagle is a small to medium-sized dog breed native to England. Its appearance is similar to that of the beagle harrier, although it is smaller, with shorter legs and longer ears. A beagle is a common dog often used in veneration and selected for hunting rabbit, deer, hare, and more generally furry game. It has a very fine sense of smell that allows it to serve as a detection dog. Popular as a pet dog due to its size, temperament, and lack of hereditary health problems, these characteristics also makes the beagle a laboratory animal. The American Kennel Club and the Canadian Kennel Club recognize two separate varieties of beagles. The 13 inches, for beagles measuring less than 33 centimeters, and the 15 inches, which includes dogs between 33 and 38 centimeters. The Kennel Club and International Canine Federation, however, recognize only one type, measuring 33 to 41 centimeters. English and American varieties are sometimes mentioned. Nevertheless, there is no official recognition of these two varieties. The Kennel Club and the International Canine Federation, however, recognize only one type, measuring 33 to 41 centimeters. English and American varieties are sometimes mentioned. Nevertheless, there is no official recognition of these two varieties. The American standard recognizes the liver color while it is clearly prohibited for the British standard. Origin Small running dogs, similar to the modern beagle, are present as early as the time of ancient Greece. These dogs were probably imported into Roman Brittany by the Romans, although no document attests to this. The trace of these small hunting dogs can be found in the laws of the royal forest of Nut Ear of Ireland. They are then exempt from an ordinance that requires to mutilate a paw of dogs that can run behind a deer. If Nut's laws are authentic, this confirms that beagle-like dogs were present in England before 1016. However, these may have been invented in the Middle Ages. In the 18th century, fox hunting became more and more popular, and these two breeds tended to decrease in number. These beagle-type dogs are crossed with larger breeds, specific to deer hunting, to produce the English foxhound. The numbers of common dogs of the beagle size decrease, and these dogs then became close to extinct. Some farmers ensure their survival through small packs specialized in rabbit hunting. Although small common dogs existed 2,000 years ago, the modern breed was developed in Britain in the 1830s from different breeds, including the Talbot, the northern running dog, and the southern running dog, now extinct breeds and probably the Beagle Harrier. The Beagle has been depicted since the Elizabethan era in literature, and more recently in film, television, and comics, notably with the character of Snoopy. Appearance The general appearance of the Beagle is reminiscent of the English Foxhound, but smaller, but the head is wider with a shorter muzzle. The facial expression is completely different, and the legs are shorter in proportion to the body. The body is compact, with short but well-proportioned legs. The English standard states that the beagle has an impression of distinction devoid of any coarse features. The standard recommends a size between 2.99 and 15.74 inches at the withers, but sizes close to this range are tolerated. Beagles weigh between 12 and 17 kilograms, females being on average slightly smaller than males. The beagle has a bulging skull, a square muzzle, and a black truffle, sometimes liver-colored. The jaw is strong with a well-aligned dentition and well-drawn lips. The eyes are wide, hazel, or dark brown, with a slight pleading look of a running dog. The wide ears are long, soft, and short-haired, curved at the cheeks and rounding at the height of the lips. The neck is strong but of medium length, with little loose skin which allows the dog to feel the ground without difficulty. The wide chest narrows on a tapered abdomen and waist, and a short, slightly curved tail that ends with a white whip.
The body is well delimited by a straight and level top line, back line, and a belly that is not overly raised. The tail should not curl on the back, but remain straight when the dog is active. The forelimbs are straight and well placed under the body. The elbows do not rotate either outside or inside and are located about half the height at the withers. The hind legs are muscular, with firm and parallel hocks, which allows a significant motor thrust, necessary for any working dog. Temperament Beagle dogs have a gentle temperament and good disposition, peaceful. Described in many standards as cheerful, they are amiable and in general neither aggressive nor shy. Reputed to be kind and very affectionate, they show themselves to be an endearing companion. Although they can be distant with strangers, they enjoy company and are generally sociable with other dogs. A study by Ben and Lynette Hart done in 1985 shows that the Beagle is considered the breed with the highest level of excitability, ahead of Yorkshire Terrier, Cairn Terrier, Dwarf Schnauzer, West Highland White Terrier, and the Fox Terrier. Beagles are intelligent, but having been bred for years to pursue animals, they are also stubborn, which can make it difficult to train. The breed is usually obedient when there is a reward at the key, but is easily distracted by the smells around them. Although it may sometimes be abrupt unintentionally, the beagle is perfect for children of all ages, because it's very playful. This is one of the reasons that makes it a popular companion dog for families. It is a dog accustomed to packs, and can be affected by separation anxiety. The beagle is not a good guard dog, even if he barks or screams when confronted with something unusual. Not all beagles howl, but some will bark when they smell potential prey. Laboratory and Other Discipline The beagle is the most used dog breed for animal testing due to its size and gentle nature. Of the 8,018 dogs used in the UK in 2004, 7,799 were beagles. That's 97.3%. Beagles are used in many disciplines, basic biology, applied human medicine, veterinary medicine, protection of the human and animal environment. The testing of cosmetics on animals is banned in the member states of the European Union. It is allowed in the United States if it's not possible to resort to other methods, but when it is necessary to test the toxicity of food additives, drugs, and certain chemicals, the FDA uses Vietnamese beagles and pigs as substitutes for the test on men. Health and Lifespan The lifespan of the beagle is on average 12.35 years, Although beagles are a healthy breed, they also fall sick and die as all living beings. But in general, the breed is known to be hardy and does not suffer from any particular health problems. Two conditions in particular are unique to the breed, Funny Puppy and Mousladine Luke Syndrome, MLS. Funny Puppy Beagles can be affected by a particular form of dwarfism, chondrodystrophy, more colloquially called funny puppy. The development of the puppy is slow and leads to bone malformations characterized by weak legs and crooked back. Mousladine Luke Syndrome, MLS Previously known as Chinese Beagle Syndrome, MLS is a hereditary disorder characterized by extensive fibrosis of the skin and joints. The syndrome is named after Beagle breeders Anton Musladin and Ada Luke. The disease affects several organ systems, including the skeleton, heart, skin, and muscle. According to the American Kennel Club's Canine Health Foundation, Beagles with Mousladin Luke syndrome are born with several defects, characterized by short outer toes on the front and sometimes all four feet, high set creased ears on a flat skull with extra cartilage in them, slant narrowed eyes, and very thick tight skin with little scruff. Affected dogs are usually smaller than average and have a very stiff gait. Seizures have also been noted in dogs affected by Mousladin Luke syndrome. 
Even at young ages, in rare cases, beagles can develop autoimmune arthritis in the joints, causing the immune system to attack the joints. Symptoms can sometimes be relieved by corticosteroid treatment. Beagles are also predisposed to hypothyroidism, a condition in which the thyroid gland doesn't produce enough thyroid hormone. Meningoencephalitis, a very serious neurological condition resembling both meningitis and encephalitis, lung narrowing, and hypercorticism, an excessive production of adrenal cortisol hormones in the body. The long ears of the beagle are sometimes prone to infections. Common eye problems in beagles are swelling of the eyelid, double eyelashes, or two rows of eyelashes glaucoma, and corneal dystrophy, which is characterized by accumulation of abnormal materials in the transparent outer layer of the cornea of the eye. In addition, a failure of nasal lacrimal drainage can cause dry eyes or, on the contrary, let tears flow on the face. Hyposecretion lacrimal is hereditary in beagles. Blue-coated beagles can also have diluted coat alopecia, a skin disease that can be treated but never cured. As a hunting dog, beagles are prone to minor injuries like cuts and sprains, but if it's inactive, the reoccurring problem is obesity, because the dog eats everything it finds and is indebted to its owners to regulate its weight. Parasites such as ticks, fleas, cestodus, and augustats, or grass seeds, can remain hidden in the dog's eyes, ears, and paws. Beagles can come into contact with many pathogens, including echinococcosis, and become sick accordingly. The beagle is the first dog breed to have been tested for susceptibility to a strain of H5N1 avian flu virus. The laboratory study showed after experimental inoculation that he could extract the H5N1 virus during a few days without any symptoms. Several types of canine influenza exist, with, as in humans, possible genetic recombination of the virus in the same infected organism. Beagles may have a behavior known as reverse sneezing, causing the breathing to be noisy as if the dog is suffocating, but the air passes well through the mouth and nose. The exact cause of this behavior is unknown. Fortunately, it's not dangerous for the dog. Hip dysplasia, common to harriers and large breeds, is rarely considered a problem in the beagles. Thank you for watching the video till the end. Now it's your turn. What dog breed do you have or would like us to talk about? Please let us know. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel to help us establish our presence on YouTube. This video is partially sponsored by DelvixGarden.com, your source for high quality food supplements and personal care products at low prices. This company has a range of premium products for your health, beauty, and personal care, including organic pine pollen, ceremonial grade matcha, medicinal herbs, hair dye shampoo, and plant-based protein for weight loss. There are links in the description. Kindly visit their store and use the coupon code FIRST20% to get 20% discount on your first order.